Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm creating a vintage themed snail mail package from the stationery products I got from Stationery Store Co. for an Instagrammer who has a beautiful Instagram page. Her name is Kazia Mariska and now I hope I'm pronouncing her name right and her Instagram page will also be linked in the description box below. So go check her page out if you also like following snail mail Instagram pages. So I am doing a collaboration with her and she's sending me a beautiful package and I'll be opening that package up on camera in the next few weeks. So today I wrote a story for my d and podcast. Um, I'll also have that podcast link in the description box below if you want to go listen to my poems and stories. I started this podcast a while ago when you guys started telling me that you really liked the stories I was writing. So this is what I wrote for you guys today. I take off my shoes and step onto the grass. My feet sink into the ground and my palms are facing the earth. I feel different. I feel as though I'm standing on top of the planet, like the world has shrunk to the size of a basketball and I'm literally standing on top of the world. Directly above me is endless. I feel my palms start to tingle and my feet go roots. I close my eyes and I feel the warmth of the sun stream onto my face. I focus on the spot between my eyes and naturally begin to smile. I'm aligned and recharged. It's euphoric. Leading up to this time of bliss and contentment, I was training my mind and nourishing my body. I had one main focus. I wanted to live in the moment and give my body what it deserved. I needed to ground in order to grow. I needed a balance to achieve the dreams I had envisioned. And over time, these simple tasks faded out of my life once again. I lost track and I became ill. I was walking through a concrete city, living an artificial life. We are alive beings circulating our planet, charging off each other's energy. No time to reflect or beauty to be seen. Off balance we stand as our wires hang loose, reaching to touch the soil beneath us, ready to neutralize and nourish. The trees call for us, but nobody is ready to listen. There is a constant buzz, a heartbeat too fast to keep up. We accelerate until a wall appears in front and by the time we see it, it's too late. Tears and discomfort, the world starts to blur and the mind shuts down. There is only a heaviness left, a pain and sadness washes over. You crawl back into the cave you once came and you seek the light that once beamed bright. It's time to recharge, it's not your fault. Life takes us on a journey and you need to be awake in order to enjoy the trip you are on. Live in each moment and when you are given a chance, take off your shoes, step onto this planet and allow your roots to grow.
thank you so much for listening to my story today. I hoped you enjoyed it and I hoped you enjoyed um, watching me make this beautiful snail mail package and I look forward to receiving my package um, from Kezia. Kezia? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Um, but yeah, go check out her Instagram page. I am doing collaboration with her today and I'll talk to you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.